All right, guys, welcome back, and welcome to my Frankenstein's monster over here. So here's the PCB rotor that the guys made for me over there at PCB Way. Those guys right there. This is my 4Q rotor that I printed out. They printed this out with an, in an SLS process using some kind of varnish to make it crystal clear like that, which I can't do with my 3D printer. So that's cool. These two coils up here normally take these iron cores. Which, so this is um, a PLA print with some BBs in there. And I've sealed it with resin. When I do put it in there, which is what these normally are for, it basically doubles the output voltage. Problem is, is that the coil stands that I have these in, these sliding stands, aren't secure enough. If I try to put this guy in here, I can feel the magnet pulling on it already. If I try to put it in there, it wants to pull it over to it. So I got to figure out a way to, not figure out, I just got to secure these down better. I can do it with um, a zip tie through the um, the opening here, which I'll probably do. <clears throat> I'm, I'm doing this one using a 3.6 volt little DC battery here instead of the power supply. And when I do it, it's 3.6 in. I get about 7 or 8 volts out up here. Of course, that's not over unity by a stretch because I'm just measuring the voltage, not the actual full power out, which is, you know, volts times amps, blah, blah, blah. But it's still kind of cool for me anyway. You know, I get people that... <laughs> that comment saying, why are you doing this? And I'm like, how am I supposed to answer that? You know, how am I supposed to answer that? I'm doing it because I'm doing it. I like it. It's fun. It's a hobby. Anyway, enough of that. Uh, I have the output of these two guys going into this fancy bridge rectifier coming, which all, well, which already has a cap, but I'm bringing it over to another cap over here. What I want to do is try to rig up a circuit to go back to this little battery to see how long I can get the whole keep the whole thing running for it'll eventually run out of power due to entropy and just the fact of the losses of the um you know through heat and friction and everything it's not going to stay running but I'd like to just see how long it would go for anyway stay tuned I got I got a clamp these down because I definitely want to use these um, iron cores. These things are nice. And they do basically almost double the voltage out. This is the run. This is the pickup. I should have it the other way around. But I'm doing it this way first. Alright? Stay tuned. <laughs> 